Hey, first off, what's going on with my shorts? D-Man showing a little skin trying to get this win. See me going in for the easy layup. That's how we start the game with the N1. What's going on? It's D-Man already. No, bringing to you some NBA 2K14, my career. Rocking with my point guard today. And I have to play with my point guard a little bit more, especially since Dwayne Wade is back. We got to get some wins with D-Wade. So bringing the ball up court, just check out the handles. Throwing out the house spin. Got him coach. Going in for the easy pass. And I just realized this. But we have Greg Stevenson who looks just like Anthony Davis, and we're also going against Anthony Davis. Damn, damn, damn that boy good. Ew, that's just Grody right there throwing down an alley-oop. But we have Grant Stevenson going against Anthony Davis. They look exactly alike. Like I said in one of my previous videos, Miss Davis, oh, she been getting around, but that's none of my business though. So you see me throwing out the Rondo, going in for the easy bucket. That's gonna put us up three points. Another thing I wanna point out, the Pelicans have a little bit of height on their team. They have Anthony Davis at the four. They have Kevin Love at the five. Now, I'm not sure how they got Kevin Love. I should have done some research because whenever I play against Kevin Love, all hell breaks loose, man. My teammates, they don't play defense. And all Love does is just throw up, turn around, face the whole game, and they all go win. So he usually get around 30 points, 10 rebounds, you know, something light. But it's just a hassle playing with Kevin Love. So, oh, a piece of candy. We get a steal right there. We're running that fast break. And I'm going to just take this all the way. I mean, Ryan Anderson, he couldn't stop that drive. I had to take that. So, we're back on defense. We're locking up right now. We're going to lock up Anderson. Look at this. Just a bad shot. A nice block by Haslam. Access denied. We out on that fast break. You know I'm running. And you already know. I see my boy Dwayne Wade on the right throwing up that alley oop. He going up to get that. Look, the legs look fine. The knees, they working. My boy D-Wade out here running and jumping. That's all I need from you, D-Wade. I don't need you taking any jump shots. But when I throw that pass up, you better catch it and throw it back down. So on this possession, I noticed that there was nobody in the paint. So I'm going to just take this all the way with the spin layup. Double tap square. I told y'all, man, that move is so official. It's so efficient. And I really only do that when we need points. And right now, we definitely need points. We're down 50 to 59. This whole game was pretty much, you know, coming from behind. Pause if needed. But we was just down the whole game, and we couldn't really score. People weren't making their shots. People weren't playing defense. So you see me? Damn, damn, damn that boy good. Just throwing it down like I always do. You all know that's the only way I can really score. I don't shoot that many three-pointers. My mid-range game, nah, it's not really there. But you know, once I get in that paint, I'm trying to freak that rim. I mean, right about now, I'm just really trying to abuse Posterizer as much as I can because I don't know how it's going to be in NBA 2K15. I mean, LD2K has said that Posterizer has been addressed for 2K15, so I probably won't be flying through the air like I can now. So for the rest of these videos, I'm really just hopping on a styling profile, get jiggy above the rim. That's what I like to do. So let's jump into the fourth quarter. You see, we're still down, but we're not going down without a fight. I mean, look at the handles, throwing out the sham god. I wanted to hit LeBron James in the corner right there, but they made me pass out the way. Now, of course, I'm going to just take it right in, pass off to Anthony Davis Jr. or Anthony Davis Brown. Brother, hey, I don't know, man. Miss Davis been getting around. I keep saying it because it's true. But like I said before, my opponent, he really couldn't contain me. It's hard to contain a beast, you know? So I just run to the paint, run right by him, go in for the easy slam. Kevin Love thought about rotating over, but he saw I was down there and he said, mm-mm. He let me finish with the easy dunk. And now I'm running the pick and roll with Stevenson. And he's going to roll perfectly right here. And he's going to get a bucket for himself. Really? This game is a good game. You know, I have a lot of points. I have a lot of assists. I've been feeding my teammates. It's just been a struggle playing defense. Of course, it's tough playing against Anthony Davis and Kevin Love down low. Especially when we have Danny Granger at the four. My boy Anthony Davis, he's been having a field day. Damn, damn, damn that boy good. Had to show Kevin Love some love on that dunk. Pause if needed. But you see me running in. Kevin Love, he really tried to block that dunk. But you cannot... You just can't. Look at the boy yoing yoing on that dunk. That man's bounce is crazy. You know he's trying to win this game, so he motivated. We're only down five points after being down double digits for most of the game. Look at this. Stevenson, once again, wide open in the lane. Easy money. That play is cash right there. So we're down one point. Five minutes left in the fourth quarter. And you know we're trying to take the lead on this possession. Run in. Kick out LeBron James. Knock it down that three-pointer. Show him not that strange range. There we go, Brown. Brown, I've been waiting on that jumper to show up to this game because... He's been throwing up breaks. I don't know why, but LeBron just has these moments where he doesn't make shots. So I'm going in once again. LeBron James in the corner. Damn, damn, damn that boy good. Strange range. LeBron James just killing it right now. Shooting these three-pointers to keep us in the game. I mean, I'm not going to lie. I do hate that he went in until the fourth quarter to knock down these jumpers. But yo, 
at least he's knocking it down. So it's 91. Oh, we can't make any mistakes, man. We can't let them get the ball back without scoring. So I'm taking that all the way. And I got lucky because I never get the foul on that animation. But most of the times, I miss it. But luckily, it went in this time. And check out Holiday trying to get an answer back with a bucket of his own. No, sir, we not having that around here. Throwing it down to LeBron James. And ah, LeBron, poor kid. You did not have to go for the dunk that way. He tried to style and profile. When styling and profiling goes wrong, basically, man. He tried to cock it all the way back. But you just gave it to the defense. But it's all good because he gets the bucket back. And now it's crunch time. 95 all. 20 seconds left. You know we have to score right here. So I'm calling for that ball from Dwayne Wade. You know, get out the way. And I'll handle this. Tried to feed Danny Granger. He didn't want to shoot. So I said, you know what? I got this like George Lopez running in, spinning. Getting a go-ahead bucket with six seconds left. 97-95. That's how we do. So we got to get back on defense. They only have six seconds. I can't let them shoot the three. And I know they want to go to Holiday. So that's exactly what they do. He's going to drop the ball. Pick it back up. Throw up a shot. I try to jump. Uh, I guess I turned into James Harden on that one. So I have the overtime coming up soon. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'll see you all later. Peace.